Bitcoin was first proposed in 2008 by an individual or group of individuals using the pseudonym Satoshi Nakamoto and was then implemented as open source software in 2009. It is widely considered to be the first decentralized cryptocurrency. Bitcoin has had a volatile history since its launch, with its value fluctuating dramatically. Some people believe that it has the potential to revolutionize the way we think about and use money, while others consider it to be a speculative bubble. Despite this, Bitcoin has become widely recognized and accepted by many businesses, including some major companies. Bitcoin mining, the process of adding transactions to the blockchain, also requires powerful computers to solve complex mathematical problems. This process consumes a lot of energy, which has been a source of criticism for the cryptocurrency. A blockchain is a digital ledger of transactions that is replicated and distributed across a network of computers. Each block in the chain contains a number of transactions, and every time a new transaction is added, it is grouped together in a block with other transactions. Once a block is added to the chain, the transactions in that block cannot be altered or deleted. Blockchains are often used to create decentralized systems, where there is no central authority controlling the system. Instead, all participants in the network have access to the same information and can make changes to the ledger together. This makes blockchains highly resistant to tampering or hacking. The most famous application of blockchain technology is Bitcoin, a decentralized digital currency. But blockchain can be applied to many other fields, like supply chain management, voting systems, digital identity, and more. One of the main advantages of blockchain is its transparency and immutability. Transactions are recorded and stored on a public ledger, accessible by anyone on the network. This creates a high level of trust among participants, as the ledger is tamper-proof and can be audited at any time. People mine Bitcoin for a variety of reasons. One of the main reasons is to earn a profit. Bitcoin mining is the process of adding new transactions to the blockchain, the public ledger of all Bitcoin transactions. Miners are rewarded with newly minted Bitcoins and transaction fees for their efforts. As the reward for mining new Bitcoins is halved every 210,000 blocks, roughly every four years, and the amount of Bitcoin in circulation is limited to 21 million, the value of Bitcoin has the potential to increase over time, making it an attractive investment for miners. Another reason for mining Bitcoin is to support the network. By participating in the mining process, individuals and organizations can help to secure the network and validate transactions. This helps to ensure that the system remains decentralized and resistant to tampering. Additionally, some people mine Bitcoin as a hobby or to learn more about the technology behind it. Bitcoin mining can also be a way for individuals and organizations to gain access to the Bitcoin network and use it for transactions and other applications. Bitcoin mining is also becoming a competitive field, with large mining operations using specialized equipment and consuming large amounts of electricity to mine Bitcoin, which also has been a source of criticism for the cryptocurrency. It is not entirely clear what happened to the person or group of people behind the pseudonym Satoshi Nakamoto. In 2008, Satoshi Nakamoto released the Bitcoin white paper and participated in the development of the Bitcoin software. However, in 2011, Satoshi Nakamoto handed over control of the Bitcoin code repository to other developers and disappeared from the public eye. They have not been heard from since and their true identity remains unknown. Some theories suggest that Satoshi Nakamoto may be a group of people, while others speculate that the name is a pseudonym for an individual, 